I'm glad I know the man who can praise his holy name. He's the same yesterday, today, and forevermore. He's king of kings and is Lord of lords. Brother, I tell you what, I'm feeling mighty good down here tonight. Praise God. He's still got all power in both heaven and in earth, and we can't praise him enough. If you got your Bibles, I want to take you over here to the book of Isaiah, the 40th chapter. The Spirit of the Lord's upon me in a mighty way, and I praise him for what I can feel tonight. Hallelujah, Brother Bill. I'm glad to know it. The 40th, woo, glory, the 40th chapter of the book of Isaiah. Go down here to the 28th verse. Take Take heed to this message tonight, praise God, because the Lord wants to do something for you. Hallelujah. Verse number 28. Has thou not known, has thou not heard that the everlasting God, the Lord, the creator of the ends of the earth, fainteth not, neither is weary. <laughs> there is no searching of his understanding. <laughs> he giveth power to the faint, <laughs> and to them that have no might, he increaseth strength. <laughs> Even the youth shall faint and be weary, and the young men shall utterly fall. But, hey, they that wait upon the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with the wings as eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. How many won't be strong in the Lord tonight? Amen. I'm telling you what, we're living in a time, church, it's time to get strong in the Lord and the power of his might. There's death on every corner. There's drugs on every corner. But I'm here to tell you, God's more stronger than anything. Thank God. It's time we rise up and be a strong arm for the Lord. How many know what I'm telling you tonight? Praise God. You know what? The devil have you to be weak and mushy and wishy-washy. But tonight I feel strong in the Lord. Lord, in the power of his might. Think about this. Praise God. Amen. What do we need to be strong in tonight? We need to have a strong prayer. When we pray, praise God. Let it be a strong one. Thank God that reaches all the way into glory that the Father sitting on the right hand side. Oh, make an intercession for you and for me. I'm glad he'll hear a strong prayer tonight. Brother, when you're praying from your heart, humble down and kneel down before an almighty God. That's a strong prayer. Hallelujah. Lord, save them children. Lord, get them off drugs. He's got power tonight to take in and change people's lives. Strong. I thought about this tonight. Brother, amen. The church ain't weak tonight. Oh, no. There's a lot of modernized and compromised and sugar-coated churches, and they become weak. But praise God, God's true church is strong as it can be tonight. Hallelujah. Strong because we're still on the rock. Strong because we still believe the gospel. Strong, brother. Amen. That's the way we need to be tonight. It's strong in the Lord. Let strength come upon you let the weak say I am strong be strong in faith tonight brother <laughs> amen faith <laughs> without faith it's impossible to please him for you must believe that he is and that he is a rewarder of them that digitally seek him brother let your faith come alive <laughs> brother be strong in it even though I can't see it I still believe it <laughs> amen that's faith <laughs> for faith is the substance of things hoped for the evidence of things not seen I'm about to get happy <laughs> thank God <laughs> because I feel a strong <laughs> anointing upon me tonight Strong in the anointing, strong in the power, strong in the might, strong in the Lord. And that's where we need to be. Mm, think about being strong in the Lord tonight. Brother A, all through the Bible, you'll read about the men of God that were strong in him, strong in God's power. And that's where we need to be tonight. Oh, thank God. How many knows that's who the devil attacks? He attacks the weak ones that's wishy-washy in this week and out next week. But brother, somebody strong in the Lord. He don't mess with them. Hallelujah. Because he knows He's about to get trampled on uh, through and by the name of Jesus. Uh, we got power over that old devil. Amen. We need to be strong. 
strong in the word of God. <laughs> Amen. Apply that word to your heart. <laughs> Amen. Where does our strength come from? It comes from this book right here. <laughs> it comes from the Lord Jesus Christ. <laughs> it comes from God Almighty himself. <laughs> Brother, once you tap into the power, you'll become strong. <laughs> and once you become strong, you'll become bold. <laughs> bold as a lion, praise God. Tearing down the wiles of the devil. Tearing down things that don't need to be there. And praise God, let your strength come alive. Strong. <laughs> Wait upon the Lord. <laughs> they shall renew their strength. <laughs> they shall mount up with wings as eagles. <laughs> they shall run and not grow weary. <laughs> oh, ain't that good news tonight? <laughs> There's a lot of people falling out by the wayside. <laughs> We're living in such a time where the great falling away is here, <laughs> where there's a famine in the land for the hearing of the Word of God. <laughs> oh, such a time we're living in, Brother Jim Stewart. <laughs> it's time to get up and get strong again. <laughs> you know what? It's a proven fact. If you sit down on your seat of do nothing, your muscles are going to turn to jelly. You're going to get out of shape. But praise God, it's time we get back in shape with the Almighty God and get strong and show this world who the, where the real power is. Where the real power is. 